Welcome to the season recap of the Eagles and the National Failure here. Now we're going to go from week one to week ten. There's a couple games not in this video due to, uh, you know, no one playing their game or I couldn't able to play the game right here. But nonetheless, we are taking on Oakland. As you see Jordan Hicks there with that beautiful user pick by your boy, me. As you see right here, Carson Wentz going deep. I love throwing the deep ball all the time. If I see, you know, usually one-on-one -on -one coverage, I try to test the uh, cornerback and look at DGB six foot five you know I had to do it and look right here a beautiful what I believe thought was going to be a pick came out a touchdown by Nelson Aguilar and and fun fact he caught it that was amazing but you see right here 10 nothing Eagles Derek Carr finds his receiver in the end zone to make it 10 6 now he tries to go for an, a field goal extra point to be exact and he misses so still 10 6 as you see right here, Carson Wentz goes deep again to the number one receiver, Jordan Matthews. The Eagles right now look amazing. Something that we needed to do since day one and season one of the National Fate League was make a statement. And but you know when you get you get a little cocky, you get a little, you feel like you got a little you know time to uh, breathe. The team comes back, and that team is the Raiders. Now 17-14 here, Derek Carr finds his man, but guess what? He gets picked off by Nolan Carroll. Pick six to the crib. Beautiful play there. Now, 24-14. Raiders are back still looking to find ways to get in the end zone like right here. Now, they're down only one point. But listen, man, when you got a running back like Tavius Murray, it's, it's, it's fine. It's an easy touchdown, especially with one yard. They score. Now, they try to go for the extra point. I don't know why I had this. I should just clip it right now, but I'm not going to. He misses the extra point to make it 24-20. So week one is already in the books, and the Eagles are undefeated. Okay, just like that. 1-0, already heading to the Super Bowl. Is that too much? It's fine. Week two, the New York Giants come to Philly. Now, this is what I like to see a lot. Now, this, as you see here, we got the rookie running back here. Week one didn't really find anything, but look right here as the rookie, Trey Halpin, finds just a smudge of a hole and makes a big game for it. Beautiful touchdown right there for the rookie. Love it. Now, right off the bat, it starts pouring. Out of nowhere. Well, I, I okay. And there's another touchdown by the rookie. I messed up. I tried to, since I got happy, that first touchdown by the rookie, I tried to put it on Twitter. Apparently, I took too long, and I got kicked out of the game. And all of a sudden, it started raining. But it doesn't matter because right now, the rookie has three touchdowns. The per, Now, that is a debut. Now, right there, 20 one to three, week two's in the books, just like that, and the Eagles are up two. Oh, week six. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I don't remember what happened through the rest of the week, so I can't tell you. I will tell you at the end of the video, which I will have the schedule of the wins and losses. But right here, he somehow Sims picks up the football, his own football. He gets in the end zone just like that. They had a nice run, but fumble, but yet the Eagles don't get rewarded. Now this is going to be a tough game. It's 3-7 here. Carson Wentz looking, and he sees Nelson Aguilar, and Nelson gets absolutely rocked. Now, to me, I'm thinking, what the hell do I have to do? I'm panicking here. So now, with 10 seconds in the first half, I said, why not let it fly? Going deep to Jordan Matthews, and we do that. Just like that. Making a statement out here. 10-7 Eagles already looking. Carson Wentz has all day in the pocket. Chucks it up again. We don't get the same outcome picked off. But right here, fourth down. They kick a field goal to make it 10-10. We have a ball game now. Fourth quarter, this is what we like to see. And you see Ryan Matthews in the backfield. Play action. Wentz looking. Looking. Fires. And he's going to chuck it to the Redskins defender. Apparently, Wentz has a big thing of doing that. Not thrown to our, the Eagles receivers who weren't a different color. But no, find a way to throw it into another team. Now right here, oh, excuse me, I have to burp, but right here he milks the clock to make it 10, 13 to 10 to the Redskins win that week, win six. I can't even talk right because I'm so disgusted in that game. That was a game to win and we blew it. Well, Eagles blew it, but now this is where it starts falling apart. Week now we face KDG's, KDG's Packers. Okay, kid, kids, but look at, just look, what? In the blue hell just happened. A beautiful run. I don't know if that's his rookie or not. I don't know. At this point, I don't even care. Because of the outcome of this game is going to be really upsetting. 
to me. Probably not to you guys. You're going to probably be like, you are the dumbest player ever. But nonetheless, look at your... How does this happen? How does this happen? My defender just bounced like bouncy balls. It's amazing. It's already 16 nothing. And hasn't reached the second half yet. But doesn't matter because he throws another touchdown. Do I believe that was Jordy Nelson? It's 23 to nothing. And Carson Wentz is throwing picks out here. But guess what? It's not just a pick. No, it's a pick six. A pick damn six. Unbelievable. I'm I'm just hurting, man. I'm just hurting bad. But like, guess what? You know what? We got a touchdown. Okay. <laughs> we got a touchdown. It's amazing. I'm loving it, all right? So we try to go for two here, and guess what? We get it. You thought I was gonna, I was gonna fail, but it doesn't matter here because he just completely destroyed me. Shout out to KDG for the ass whooping. And just to add insult to injury, he goes for it. Goes for it to make it 40 to eight. Gotta love the guy, right? What a dick. That's <laughs> just playing. <laughs> just playing. So the Packers completely murder the, uh, the Eagles here. So week 10, we take on Mark My Words as Cowboys. Now you know. You know how the outcome is. It's going to be a tough game. So right here, we're going to take it to the second quarter as he scores a touchdown here. But nothing less. We got it was a it was a pretty good game though. As you see right here, he kicks a beautiful field goal to make it nine nothing. Now I'm really happy that it wasn't really a blowout. I see here third and goal. We stop them to make it 12 0. They kick a field goal. So, with, with this being said, you know, it wasn't a really good game. As you see, Carson Wentz gets destroyed, and DGB comes out with a beautiful catch. But it doesn't happen. Nothing really happens here. As you see, right, we lose 12 to 7. It was a good game back and forth with defense right here. So, here is the, the schedule of the wins and losses right here. As you see, week three, we lose by two. 25 27 then we lose we lose to oh man this is really upsetting because they're close games and we just we don't know what to do but we tie with carolina oh my god this season i just want the season to be in that's all i want i want the se season to be over but if you guys enjoyed the video please leave a like comment subscribe uh, hope hopefully we just win out the rest of these games and you know hopefully we can do something but if not Hashtag trust the process might be coming. We might be tanking the rest of the season to get a nice draft pick. Okay, I don't know. I don't know. That could be happening. But this is your boy Potsy, and I'm out. Peace.